We got here a 2007 GMC dump truck that needs a new PCM. Well, I tried programming it with regular SPS2 and it keeps failing, so sometimes you gotta pull out the old tech stream, downloading the software onto it, and hope it works. All right, well now I'm connected to the computer and it says it's programming in progress. Beginning high-speed communication. Downloading calibration file. I'm sure there's another way to do this without this. <laughs> Maybe clone it, or I think you can get um, PIS2000 on the computer if you speak to them. But well, if you have it, why not use it? All right, well, it says programming successful. Turn off ignition. Now, I don't know if this thing's going to start because I have no idea if it was diagnosed correctly that I needed a computer. And there we go. See? All the calibrations are the same. So, it actually successfully programmed it with the Tech 2. Well, it was a wrong diagnosis because it's a crank no start like it was before and there's no fuel pressure. Captain over there. And they changed the fuel pump, they said. I have injector pulse, I have spark, I have no fuel pressure. A little bit of fuel comes out, so I think they changed the filter in line also. I don't know, I gotta get them to move the back. Well, just an update, I went down to the pump and this is the return line to the pump and if I seal it off, the truck starts and runs. So it's just somehow all the fuel's going back. So I think it's a bad regulator over here. I'm not sure, whatever. He, the guy's gonna go buy a regulator because it was, it was like missing parts and someone put like cuticles on it. So I think that was the whole issue. But, all right, I got the program on the computer with Tech 2. Thanks for watching.